you can't tell by looking at a, at a truck from afar. I mean, RV folks, RV folks have a problem because they say, hey, I saw a trailer go through there. I can go through there. <laughs> and some of these RVs are now like 13, 13, 3, 13, 4. That truck might have been 12, 6. And without seeing, without seeing the marking on the side, they say, hey, I'm, I'm gangbusters, man. I'm going to go right through there and bang. Next thing you know, they're, they're – and so – the, those elevated trains, they're all, uh, if you know, the trick with them is, well, we measured all of them. We measured all of them. So what happens is they, so if you have a whole, a whole, if you're going to go in the front of the elevated train, you're going to go here and you're going to go six blocks, or it'll tell you the lowest point. So if you've got, on, if you got on your trail, you've got 13, six, it'll tell you, you know, it'll, it'll have 13, four, you'll have 14, four, and then it'll have one spot that says 13, four. It'll let you know the lowest point, not just the entrance, you know, 300 yards ahead yep. you're going to you're going to hit something there so you don't go in there because once you get in there you can't get out or you have to make a right turn you know and then the other trick with with the subways is you have to know how to make turns you can't make them tight you have to go way out into the left lane you have to pull in the left lane everybody's going to honk you and you have to stand there and then you just make the big right turn you know because you made a mistake and then they all get mad at you and <laughs> But you're clean, and you're out of there, and then you call the folks and say, you know, I'm coming to you. How do I get there without? Uh... Get too clean. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's it, there's so many there's so many stories of, uh, you know, bridges and 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 stuff, and and I've experienced a lot of it, and it's. You know, we never had this technology. I mean, I started driving in the 80s when I stopped running like New York, New Jersey. We were looking at about 1995. And from then on, I was running only in Canada here. So for a lot of that, you know, you're, the 80s and 90s was when I was trucking down there. And there was no technology other than a CB radio and a phone booth. Yeah, and yeah, that was it, yeah, right? That was your technology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's good to see that you've got this out now. Because a lot of drivers, you probably see it too. I see it on social media they're just hitting bridges or they're going into the back of, you know, massive accidents on the highway. And I'm going, how could, how do you not know that that's, well, they've stopped using the CB or they're not, you know, paying right. attention to some of the technology and stuff like that. That's about, so yeah. that's, that's, yeah. that's very cool. What, tell me about the name. Giraffe tree four is great, but people would think you're at the zoo. How come you came up with that name? I, I get it. Cause it's all about height and bridges, but I think we had a little artwork when we stunned my son, Brian and I, we had a little artwork done and it was, I guess it was. <laughs> Some people say it's a great name. Other people say, "What's that stupid name?" Man? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was just a, a sanction of ha having a long neck or having a, having a, being able to see above you. It, I guess it, it refers to the ability to see a, a, above you, you know. Yeah. And uh, so, but we never really. I mean, now we sort of have it, and people know it. So uh, it's it's not worth back backing off it though. We just. Uh, but I remember when I first started driving, I was, you know, young and I was, um, this is a trucking story and you guys will appreciate it. Uh, I used to go, I used to drive upstate and pick up a load of milk yeah. every day, day shop. So it was a whole load. They have 30 stores. So it was a 53 footer full of uh, milk. And uh, so I went up and I came back and, and uh, I, I did it. In, I did it in nine and a half hours. All right. So I'm young and I'm stupid, you know, so, and I'm still stupid, but I'm not yet. <laughs> so a driver comes over to me, he says, he says, Frank, he says, uh, how long did that take you? I said, I, I did it. Nine, I said, I was sort of say, yeah, I did pretty good. I did it nine and a half hours. He says, Frank, that's an 11 hour run, you know? And I said, no, but I did it nine and a half hours. He says, Frank, that's an 11 hour run, you know? And I said, Oh, okay. I understand. I understand. Yeah, we used to get <laughs> an old timer. In other words, you did it too fast. <laughs> <laughs> and he was an old timer yeah. and a uh, big, 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 strong kid. You know, I said, older guy. And he said, okay. I said, oh, okay, all right. You know, so because I did, tr I did try to whip it back. I mean, I was, you know, I was going probably going too fast or something. You know, I mean, I never drove fast because that's the biggest. You know, we can talk about driving the way to driving. You know, it's it's probably the worst thing. Um, but uh, yeah, I'll never forget that. That was my first lesson in uh, working with you know. And now they know where you are. I mean, now they now they so you know it's now everybody knows where you are, right? I mean, uh, we we've had that we've had that many times. We had one guy who, who was supposed to be on a three day run. He came back the next day, and we said, "What the heck are you doing here?" And he said, "Oh, I did all my deliveries because the guy before him had had it said it was always three days." You could almost, you know, you know, I was people used to tease me. They go, "Bruce, no matter how many deliveries we send you out with, you come back at four o'clock." 
o'clock. It doesn't matter whether your truck's full or truck's empty. You still come back at four o'clock. Cause I, I, can, I can waste time as well as anything. And I can always get the truck washed or whatever like that. So yeah. Yeah. 